Hello. Hi. Um, so today we want to oh. demonstrate um, just how to do the mirror exercise and like the basics of the spiritual tool that we use and yeah. this is how you heal your upsets and how you heal your union with your twin flame. Sage, yeah. Sage is going to walk me through an upset or like how I'm feeling right now. And yeah. Um, yeah, we'll just go through. There's four steps and we'll go through each part of it. That's Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Yeah, this is how you do it in real time. Real time. Here yeah. we go. Okay. Okay. So <laughs> now say what you're feeling. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> or, or maybe you'd ask me, hey, how are you feeling? Yeah, how are you feeling? <laughs> say right? how you're feeling. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, um, I am feeling a bit sad right now. You feel sad? Yeah, I'm angry, a little bit sad, yeah. Okay. Um, why? Well, <laughs> before we started this video, Sage yeah. and I got into a little bit of a disagreement, so I think I'm feeling sad because um, we were disagreeing with each other. Mm-hmm. That's why I feel weird because we were just talking about it, so it's weird to be like, "Why?" <laughs> well, <laughs> on the we're camera. just we're just showing. I know we're showing the people. That's why. Yes. Yeah. Anyway. So. So, okay. So I just found the upset, right? So that would be step one. Is yes. I'm so it would be like I'm upset uh, with my twin flame because we are disagreeing. Um, yeah. And then step two is you turn. You change all the nouns to pronouns, so the upset would be, um, so I'm upset with myself because I'm disagreeing with myself. Um, and then step three, is there any truth to that? So what I do then is look within myself and see like, is there any truth to that anywhere? Am I disagreeing with myself anywhere at all within myself? And the answer is yes, I found this part of me or he feels like he doesn't agree with himself. Mm. Do you want to do step four? Oh, yeah. <laughs> step four is find that part of yourself mm -hmm. with inside yourself. Um, ask him, what does he need to feel loved right now? Yep, and he's just asking for a hug. Yeah. So I'm just going to give myself a hug. Yeah. It's hug. It usually it's just a hug, mm -hmm. yeah. Cause yeah, love is. And I do this simple. until I feel, like relief and peace. Like, um, you should feel. Yeah, just more peaceful after you you do this. You should feel like a shift in energy. Yeah. Okay, and I am feeling. Yeah, a lot more peaceful there. Good. Yeah. Do you feel anything else that... Or does that part of you need anything else? No, I think I feel complete there. That's good. Yeah. Okay. And then can you bring... Can you, um... I don't know. Integrate that part of yourself? Mm-hmm. So, yeah. So, then the very last step, even after the fourth part... Like after you feel like you're, you've you completed that, like you feel peaceful and relief, you just want to choose to like melt that part of yourself into your heart and integrate the healing into your heart. So I choose to integrate yeah. this healing into my heart and just let this part of myself melt into myself here. And yeah, feels complete. Okay. We did it. That's it. That's yeah, it. That's it. That's yeah. the mirror exercise. It's how you heal yourself and love yourself, bring peace and relief to yourself. And you can do this with any upset. And as you saw with us, like uh, mine was a twin flame upset. So literally any upset you have with your twin flame, you just mirror it. And because um, they are your perfect mirror, they're your divine complement. And uh -huh. uh, this heals your union. And yeah. Yeah, and a twin flame, the, the twin flame is your perfect mirror with everything, but 
yeah, life is your mirror, so you can yeah, mirror anything. You can mirror anything that's upsetting you. Yeah, and then, yeah, that's it. So it does take some practice, though, to be able to do this. Um, feeling your feelings, um, yeah. identifying the upset, like what are you actually upset about? This one was like pretty easy. Sometimes it's not super easy to find exactly what is upsetting to you. Um, anything really, any part of it can trip you up because it's so different from how we're taught to A, view reality and B, relate to ourselves and um, our emotions. So yeah. It takes a lot it of takes, presence. Yeah. You really have to learn to sit with yourself yeah and really get be honest like how am i feeling and be honest like oh this is um within me like if you're experiencing an ups or charged ups or upset feeling mm -hmm. the truth is is that um you know whatever you're experiencing in your reality is happening because it's within you so you really do have to be willing to like see that and um love yourself there yeah <clears throat> yeah so yeah. that's why like it takes practice like um i wasn't really super good at doing it for a while you know for several months i would say yeah after i me, started yeah it definitely took me a couple months i'd say to like learn how to actually feel my feelings and like find the upset and stuff yeah, yeah. but i also didn't have a coach for a while so when I, yeah, first came to the community for just a little. So I would really recommend that too, mm -hmm. is just find a coach who you resonate with. It could be, it could be us. <laughs> so go to the links below, um, get the introductory course, claim your um, introductory session with us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or with any coach who resonates with you in our community. Yep. And yeah. All right, we'll cool. see you. <laughs> see you in the Bye. next one. See Bye. you in the next one. Like and subscribe. <laughs>